Alright guys, I am back with some more Godfather 2. A uh, bit of recap of what happened. We were in Cuba with Michael, our boss, and the rebels attacked. Our boss was shot, and Michael appointed us the dawn of our own family. To keep in mind, for those of you who haven't seen the last part, we are no longer working for Michael. We are our own boss, but we are now allied with Michael. So we're at the compound, and we have to know... We have to go speak with Michael now you about something uh, very urgent, you according to him. So let's talk to him. I think Carmine's finally getting the message that you're boss of this city, not him. Now he's getting the message all right, loud and clear. I just hope I've put enough guards at my new places. Keep them defended, Dominic. Carmine will try to take them back sooner or later. I know, but I don't want to be spread too thin. If Carmine's planning what I think he's planning, then I'm going to need more muscle. Another soldier. I agree. Frank will probably know some good places to find the recruit. Make sure to get someone whose skills complement your own. Don't ever assume your enemies will stay still. They're always planning, just like us. Having another soldier will give you an edge over whatever Carmine has up his sleeve. In this life, there's nothing more important than... Alright, so as you guys just heard, we have to go and hire another soldier. Go to tribute... Uh, Triboro Park and recruit another soldier. So let's talk to Frank, because clearly we can talk to him. Frank, it's time to add some fresh blood to the family. Another soldier already? Michael must be serious about hitting Carmine. That's great news. You'll need the extra muscle. Believe me. I only want the best, Frank. You know New York better than anyone. Where can I find the top guys? Yeah. Associates will hang out at any of your businesses, hoping they get noticed by you, capiche? So go back to your turf every now and then and see who's around. Of course, there's the occasional lone wolf, too. Always keep your eyes peeled for guys who want to join the family, Dominic. Alright, that is a great hint of advice for those of you guys who play this game uh, and don't know where to find guys to hire. There are always guys hanging around at your uh, businesses around the city. And that's a pretty good idea to actually to go and hire a new guy because we still I still only have one guy so it's just me and him practically doing shit. But uh, Michael gave us a good place to go look for a new recruit, uh, Pororo Park or something like that. But let's go uh, check this guy out. Oh, there he is right there. I can see him already. So here we are. This is only much of a park. This is like like a mini basketball court. Or not basketball. Yeah, it is a basketball court. Okay. All right, so this is this is our guy. Let's take a look at him. I should take Bill Barty. That's his name. I need a good soldier, someone who can hold his own. That you? With my muscle and your reputation, we could make some serious coin. You interested? Specialty. What about your skills? What are you good at? I know my way around explosives. Things that go boom. Sometimes you just gotta get to the point. Alright, so he's a demolition know? expert. And he's advanced, that's good. We need an advanced guy. Uh, and demolition's expert brings the heat. If, it, if a strong door or concrete wall was blocking your path, he can bring it down. More importantly, he can set charges to building's gas main. When they go off, the building will completely shut down. Alright. Oh, shit. Sorry. <laughs> I pressed the wrong button. Right I wanted to hire him. Sorry, Bill. Dominic, I'm still here. I'm, I'm still ready to go. What do you say? Yeah, you're in. So, we got a deal? You're in. Welcome to the family. Welcome to the family, Bill. Alright, so we just had to hire Bill Barty, our second soldier to the family. As you guys can see here, this is our family tree. And as we unlock more and more guys, or I guess hire more and more guys, see this four soldier slots, so we'll be getting two more guys to soldier slots. Then we'll be promoting two guys to capo, promoting one guy to underboss, and then eventually getting our consigliere, who is basically the advisor to the dom, which is now me. Yay. So, uh, actually what I want to do, as usual, I want to uh, make Bill look the part for our family. So, uh, he's basically wearing the right stuff, except it's too fancy for just a soldier. Until they're... Um, really in the family. I, I don't want them wearing anything too fancy. Well, I guess when you're a soldier, you, you are in the family. I mean, I just want him uh, wearing a, kind of a more basic attire, but that still fits our kind of code of conduct. I, I'm saying that like there's rules, but um, I want him to look like he's a mobster, but then at the same time, don't want him to look like he's too uh, 
don't want to look like that really that he's that important if you guys know what I mean um, until you're a capo I don't think anybody should really be wearing a suit besides me I know it sounds a bit self-centered but that's just how things are in, in the real mafia like, like, like also it's it's just just the truth all right so I think he looks pretty good so um, let's get back to what we were doing <coughs> all right Bill, welcome to the family. Let's go. This is my Let's stick together. Crew versus family. F family members can be added or removed from your active crew using the family tree to pick who to bring. All right, so we, so we got our two guys. Okay, complete your crime ring. Take over La Maison Rouge. Okay, uh, that is a strip club, by the way. That's um, like they said, complete okay, our crime ring. So that's the, the last and final strip club in New York, which will which will. Yeah which will complete our crime ring of prostitution in New York which like all rackets or crime rings will give us a, sp a specialty and in prostitution's case I'm pretty sure um, guards are cheaper that's I'm pretty sure they'll tell us in a minute so yeah here we are we're at La Maison Rouge this is actually the most fancy strip club in the game actually this place is really nice you actually visit here a couple times for like the main story like just besides this you do do it a couple times um, but um, yeah let's go check this place out so using our oh, uh, point it a crew action icon these then press B to order your crew to perform their specialty so this is a good time to show you guys an example of special specialization we just hired Bill Barty a demolitions expert so we can get him to blow up the back door so we can sneak blow in and not just barge barge the front door and just get our asses killed so um yeah we can use we the specialty to our advantage just to kind of sneak them. in through the back well since it's blowing up it's not really much sneaking but i mean it's uh, finished, boss. better than just barging through through the front if you ask me so let's uh, take cover behind nothing just crouching in the back swag all right guys let's go uh we have a bit of firepower i think we have enough firepower to kick some ass Ah, shit, they're already here. Okay, let's just, whatever. Fuck it. Let's just, let's just barge in now. Fuck it. Let's go. Okay, let's, let's take over this place. Yeah, see, yeah, they got 11 guards, so this place is a lot more armed than the other one. Than the place we just took over before. Um, Sweet Life Bakery. That had, that had like five Who's guards or something. Clean up that the place when you're dead. Guards. This place is loaded with guards. It's not going to be as, as easy to take over. Ow. I'm almost dead. Jesus Christ, that guy shot me up good. Oh! What? Wow. The guy standing right next to the door blew my head off with a shotgun. Wow. Wow. That is retarded. Good thing the hospital is extremely close, or I'd be furious. Okay, you know what? I just hijack this car. And yes, you can do that in this game. And you won't get it. Grand Theft Auto style. Let's go. Let's get out of here. The fuzz are after us. Okay, let's go. Um, okay, good thing we're already pretty well back at the at the strip club. And this is actually the front, but I. I'd still like to go into the back. Actually, I think at this point in the game, you can actually only go into the front. Yeah, see how fancy this is? They got like a big thing here and stuff too. All right. Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure at this point, the only way in is actually th through the back. Um. Okay. Oh wow. Oh yeah, that's right. It's already blown blown down because he blew it up before. Alright, so let's just barge in now. It's a gun. <laughs> yep, I already read that. In trouble. Stay close, alright? Good thing is, the guards we killed are still no still no longer here, so they so still only um there's actually only four guards now, there's not even and they're all just standing right here, so I'm practically killing all of them right now. Pretty awesome. And that was the last guard. So this place is practically ours, guys. The boss is not in here. Wait, did they have any shit? Mm, just some guns, okay. 
Um. Okay, let's go. Here, here she is. All right, bitch. Let me be. Give me the money. No, I'm kidding. Here. <sighs> we can do this the easy way or the hard way. Oh, there's her weakness. J so getting beat up is like her weakness. Okay, that's enough. You want your girls to stay safe? Then why are you working with these assholes? Let me run this place, okay? All right. You want this racket? It's yours. Take it. Fantastic. Our Each crime ring is complete. Get you one step closer to the top. See that? Crime ring. Oh no, it's brass knuckles. You now control the prostitution crime ring. Crime ring bonus, brass knuckles. You and your crew will dish out pummeling damage from hand-to-hand -hand attacks. That's pretty beast. So now everyone in our crew has brass knuckles, which makes our obviously our melee attacks a lot more powerful. Until one of our prostitution business or uh, rackets gets um, taken over or gets destroyed or something. That's why we have to be very cautious about our about our completed crime rings because we want those to stay intact. Our daily income is now two thousand three hundred forty-four dollars. Wonder if anyone's tried to contact you. Yeah, let's go use the phone, because Michael's going to be contacting us. Oh, never mind. Take over more of Carmine's businesses. Alright, let's go do that. Let's go through the front door. Let's get out of here and style the front. Alright, let's do it. Our stolen vehicle. Wait, hold on. That's our car over there. Well, it's not ours, but it looks like ours. That's more realistic to ours. Let's, let's just take it. Whatever. I think this is the exact same car, except it's not really ours, but it's the same car. So it really gives a shit. Alright, uh, I'm a great driver. Alright, let's do this shit. Okay, let's map this thing out. Let's take over more of Carmine's businesses. So, show. Alright, well, let's start with a basic business. The weakest. You gotta start with the weak. The weakness are the easiest. Richie's Tavern. Is it, which is um, a bar, I'm pretty sure. So let's head there first. And then as I could see there, the remaining two businesses after Richie's Tavern are um, drug, um, like cartel, or like drug smuggling plants. Which will be difficult to, to take over compared to Richie's Tavern, which is just a basic bar. But, like I said, starting with the weak is probably a better strategy in my opinion. Alright, so let's head in here. Take it over this by force. A big piece of the we'll own this town yet. I said I was going in with a baseball bat and just kick the crap out of everybody. Hey, half pint. Take a hike. <laughs> I'm ready. Hope you have insurance, oh. asshole. Holy shit. Okay, that's just disgusting, dude. That was brutal. That was like gory. Which one's your favorite? Look at this, dude. That's disgusting. Just shoving the baseball bat in his throat, and then like beating the crap out of him with it. I prefer just hitting them. The other way is just too gory for me. You want to fight? Found the owner. Hold on a second. The guy's running. One of your businesses is under attack. Go there now, or use a family tree to send your men to defend it. Okay, I'm gonna send my guys. I think. Wait, hold on. What business is under attack? Oh shit! That's Sweet Life Bakery, and they have two made guys over there. Okay, you know what? Yeah. After this place, I'm gonna head over there. Yeah, I think they can hold out for like two seconds. Hopefully, I, I, I really hope so. Wait, where the fuck did the boss go? He just run away. Where is he? Oh shit, there's more of them too. Aha! This is probably where he went. Is he up here? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Where the hell did he go? Okay, well, guys, I'm just gonna stop it here. It's been Game Expert, not uh, Canadian Six Nine Gamer. See you guys next.